Hello everyone and welcome back for some more Silostra Direfin in Grimhammer. And last episode we finished the Necrofex Colossus building, so we're definitely getting some of those. We're just looking for some place to sit for three turns and just recruit. And I figured these guys had a lovely place, so I'm gonna take their home. That seems fair, so let's just hop into the fight. Okay, so this, this map is pretty good for us. We uh, like being on hills, because it gives a very good line of sight for our artillery. And also our gun line can just shoot over our uh, other people. So that's good. It's harder when they are actually engaged, unless we engage like right here, so they can just so, uh, just so shoot over. Oops. That was not what I meant to do. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're just gonna uh, you're fine there because you're gonna have to pop up some knights um, these guys are gonna be up front because they are gonna take the brunt of the attack because we're gonna replace them uh, let's send some of these out to the edges because they are gonna tank stuff but they don't have to be in the middle and then we're gonna send some... Oh, actually, you should be back here. You have long range and you have a buffing thing. So, that's fine. And let's pop out the other one. Put that on. Because we want that acceleration and charge bonus. Because that's a big charge bonus difference. Good, and now you can go... Forward. Let's plop out some more of those. That's good. Oh, right. Um, are you in position? You are. Um, let's buff all of those. Grab you. Where is the... Didn't they have a... Uh, a stack of temple guards? Where are those? Well, I'm not missing any. They're all in the center. Okay, well, get the Saurus, Saurus Warriors, they're just club variants, so... Oh, and they're running away. No, they're just posturing. And round two. Come on. There we go. It's not as pretty, but still pretty good. Hmm. It was kind of weak, actually. I did some damage, which is nice. Oh, we killed the enemy lord. That was quick. Very nice. So, um, I want to take you and find some temple guards. There, we got some. Oh, killed another enemy lord, I guess. Good. Let's run up a little bit. I mean, these feral cold ones are pretty weak in comparison so not too worried about that and we'll keep these kind of close so they they will help with shooting a little bit won't they yeah go on shoot I want to see you shoot okay, you're lazy come on shoot bastard Okay, um, wait, sending skinks at me? Oh, that's not gonna stand. We're gonna have to kill these skinks. Come on, come on. Trudge through those, those damn good girls, clever girls. Ah, stupid. So, these are fine. Let's send you into the Croxigores. Good. Pop that. You can help as well. We are doing fine. These are dying, but that's fine. You should go help over here. We can plop up some more of those. Oh, and speaking of plopping things out, we can also send out some more horses. Come on, get in there. There we go. Now we get a good skink charge. 
I mean, skinks are so satisfying to plow down with uh, with uh, cavalry. They're so low mass. So it's just, it just feels good. It feels right. Uh, we should back you up a little bit, actually. You are having pains. Send you in. You should be doing stuff. And you're very healthy, so we don't need to use your heal yet. Let's send you in there. And actually, let's just cycle you in, draw you out, go fight that. And let's send you in here. It's uphill, but it is a rare charge. Rare charges are always wonderful. Good. Charge into that. There we go. Look how satisfying that is. Skinks never change. So nice to ride into. And everyone seems to be doing fine. Um, let's get a wave there. Nice. Okay, so... Um... I guess we can get a Kraken's Call there. That's gonna be good. There we go. Get the skinks and some of the Croxigore. Ah, we caught some of them, so the rest had to get here. Oh, actually, they're running away. But we're doing some good damage there. And since we are gonna have to fight this in a siege as well, um, I figure... Oh. Queen Bess ran out of ammo. We should have given them some more during the fight, but I guess this, it's a little late now. Go kill that. Because I don't want them to have too healthy of a garrison when we fight them again. So we're just gonna hunt stuff down. Usually don't do that too much, but... Oh, they got away. Uh, get those croxigores maybe. No, we're not gonna get there. Get these sort of spares. We should be able to get those, right? There we go. Get some damage in there and there we go. Okay, so we did lose a animated Hulk, but like I said, it doesn't matter because we are gonna we are gonna exchange them for Colossi, so it's fine. And I mean, we don't need that. That is no amount of money, and we got way more than we need, so let's just unit replenishment. Oh, are you gonna run away? No? Okay, that's fine. Let us just auto resolve that. And I guess we should have put that on, like, those maybe. I don't know. That's fine. That is a lot of sack money. You know what? Take it. There we go. Ooh, they had a gemstone mine. So we could have gotten this at tier 3, but honestly, I don't think there's anything at tier 3 that we necessarily need from there. So, um, you can go and join there next turn. That is perfect. I mean, it is a little unfortunate because we do have a rank 9 uh, animated hulk. They are pretty strong. I mean, 90 melee attack, they'll hit everything. And that's a lot of damage. But I'd rather have the tankiness of Rotting Promethean, honestly. The damage is way less. Not as offensive, but... Actually, that is not a lot of health. I thought they had more health. Hmm. So... 
Hmm. I still think we get rid of. Hmm. Well, the armor is actually quite a big difference. I'll keep this because we mostly want them to hold hold the front line. We don't need them to do anything fancy. So, we can get our rotting... No, Necrofix Colossus, not rotting Prometheans. Is there anything else? Well, we're... Well, we are... Uh, recruiting, we can check the global, but there's not really anything we want. Could get some mortars, but... I don't think we need our mortar. We are getting the Necrofix Colossus and they have great range damage and uh, well a little bit shorter range than the mortar. Whoops. Oh actually they're longer range than the mortar. Yeah so they're just better. So we're gonna have to make a little room for our vampire. This one is actually the least experienced so let's get rid of that. They had a little bit more. And is there anything else? We could get some of our knights. Maybe some some more questing knights or knights of the realm. I mean they are really good but we do get a couple of them during combat. And I think that is enough. Yeah. I would like to exchange these for the gunnery variant, but this is fine. Capable. We'll go with that. And finish shark bait off, so he's very tanky. A good and this guy. We want headhunter and none of these are very good. I mean I guess foreign territory leadership is fine. Adequate. And this guy. Ooh. Middle defense for Sirene units isn't bad. We do have a couple of Sirenes. So I guess we. Um, I guess we lower some armor and next turn we'll buff our sir Sirenes a little bit. They have so much middle defense. They're pretty strong. And were we doing something with you? I don't remember. We peaced out with Malekith and he's actually hanging out right there. Is it time? I'm gonna go have a sneak peek at him. What's your army like? Knows no limits. Let's see, when we get closer. Huh, that is pretty weak. We could kill Malekith. Malekith King of but I don't think we'll gain anything from that. And I think... Oh, right. Yes. We can get some of those. Right, 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 right. So, we also... What else do we get? We can get these. They... That's not very good. Can start getting this to get to Death Shriek. Which is pretty good. Or we get that to get the gunners and deck deck gunners. Um, yeah, deck gunners, because they're pretty good. I like deck gunners. I guess get that. Let's see if we can get to the terror guys. And it's growing fairly quickly. We'll see if we get some. Yeah, so we'll be stuck here for three turns, but that is fine. Oh, you will go and join, finally. You've been missed. And that's a pretty good army. I would like to change this and, like, maybe one Sirene or one of these to uh, rotting Promethean gunnery mobs, but it's fine. We could get some man-eaters. I do like me some man-eaters. 
But that will probably be another army. So, we're just gonna leave you there. And I guess it's time for another lord, maybe. I do like my deep the most. Plunderers gain loyalty from gain loyalty from sacking and raiding. Yeah, that's pretty good. That is not the one I bought. <laughs> that's a smuggler. Whoops. Um, get out of here. I. All oh, right. So we'll get a new one next turn. That's fine. Oh well. Ready. Oh, you took Silver Tor. I don't like that Silver Tor exists. I am the Witch King. So we're gonna pick a fight with Malakith again. Let's see. You are pretty strong, right? Speak. You're actually not that strong. What happened to you? You used to be stronger, didn't you? Well. Oh, all of them. So, they're not gonna come here, I think. They're not gonna come here because they are surrounded by enemies and those are... Yeah, I don't think you're gonna be a problem either. So, yeah, let's declare. That's fine. And let's kill Malekith. And um, this is actually gonna take a lot of damage. So, I guess... Malekith stands for most of that, I would assume. Oh, but he's on a chariot. Huh. Yeah, okay, let's fight this. Okay, so most of their things don't have any shields, which is great. The biggest problem is their bolt throwers. But these ladies have stock. So we can probably take care of that. Come on, there we go. By just backstabbing them. We are going to take some damage from their their bolt throwers, but this way I don't think it's going to be too much of a problem. And we're going to want to deploy fairly far back. Okay, yeah, those were... Oh, stop it. There we go. So let's pull you back to there-ish. Pull you back a little further. So... And then we... Stagger these as well, as usual. Hmm. Maybe a little bit more space. Like so. That is fine. And we'll put you over there. They're aquatic. That's fine. Put you over there. That's fine. And you still need to be placed like so. And we can pull you back a little bit. We want to have quite tight formations here. Have them come all the way up to us. There we go. And we can probably get some more mana than that. Good. So. Why are you advancing so much with your bolt throwers? It's weird. Why are you doing that? So, you're gonna go straight towards that. And you are gonna go straight to that. Good. Now stop shooting my guys. Not a fan. Well, they're not doing that much damage. And this guy is not gonna have a good time. Fuck that. Are you shooting? You are. Good. So, let's just 
back away a little bit. Send you in over there. And here's Malekith. That's fine. So, are we even shooting Malekith? Come on. Let's put your back into it. Let's turn that on. Why? Why is this on cooldown? Did you do something to me, Malekith? You bastard. But we're dealing loads of damage to them, which is great. You can stay there. Go throw stuff at them. Oh. Why? Ah. Oh. Those cooldowns are weird. But let's pop you out and back you off. What are you shooting me at no with now, you stupid. What? How'd you get away? I specifically told him to kill you. Okay, let's turn you like so. Start shooting there. Shoot that. Target Malekith. Target Malekith. Target Malekith. And... Get another one of those going. Go in and kill that. Go and kill that. Oh, and you should die. You should die real quickly. Come on, like one volley and that's dead. Come on, get there. How hard? You don't have to turn around all the way, just turn around personally. You weirdos. Okay, shoot that. Kill that. Kill that. And you can turn like so, go and kill that, Your, those are gone and dead, you can go and fight that, actually, you still haven't broken that, come on, kill that, hunt that, oh, kill Malekith please, should be able to shoot that, No. Shoot those. And shoot him. Oh. You need to get out of there. Malekith should be dying, so... He should be fine. Yeah, there he is. Okay. So. That... We only lost a little bit. And uh, we almost lost our lord, which... Wouldn't have been great. Because I didn't really pay enough attention. But yeah, I underestimated him. He was... Pretty strong. But... We can just do like so. And we have a bunch of stuff we can recruit here. So... Well, actually, not that much. We can get a new one of those. And I think we're going home now. But we killed Malekith, so we... Wait, didn't get a trait? There, there's a trait. Whoops. Uh, we get... Ah, Frenzy and Income from Raiding. Nice. I never, like, memorized all of the unique Lord buffs, so... Actually, don't do that. It can stay as tier 2, it's fine. And you should be one more turn, right? No, nope, we haven't passed since then. Still just two. So, we have tic-tac-toe in the area. And a lot of um, heroes. But, we definitely want to kill him in a bit. Just to get the trait. I don't know what trait it is. So, probably something that has to do with flyers. Because that's, that's all he does. So. Ooh. Neat. I think that's bad for us though. Because we are mostly ranged. 
and um, if every every everything has better uh, melee weapon then uh, yeah that's not great for us i guess but we'll we'll manage right and we are getting that new lord now and it was the yeah this one i think i think it was this guy either way let's get that guy and um yeah, yeah get more of those i like the boarding crews let's get some i do like those get some of those and just these oh actually um we have a gunnery white over here that i forgot about and this is one more turn and i guess we'll finish this because well we're gonna have to sooner or later so we might as well do it now Admiral of the fleet. these are building that is fine oh we should actually get some mortars as well mortars are fun fun to have would prefer it to be cannons but we don't have cannons So, Tic-Tac-Toe <laughs> sent an ar armada of uh, heroes at me, but we are done here, so we don't really care what they do. Yeah, so... Could go try this out at this place. It's not much of a garrison. The secondary army is just a lord, and they are hurt and not doing very not well not i don't i don't know how words work uh, they are not replenishing replenishing very quickly oh dear words are not my friend right now it seems but we can put an ambush here just in case they decide to go because i disappeared ambushes are weird in this game because you kind of see them and then they just disappear Anyway, uh, we were gonna get this for our our vampire because we want her to survive this time. And right, they aren't high level enough. So you can go and actually. Um, right, we wanted another another uh, boarding crew what for this them? guy so he'll steal one from from here when they're done that's Let fine or do we just rely on the new gunnery gunnery white ah this is fine whatever uh rotting promethean yes please you can cause horror is also good And these are all pretty nice. Let's do smuggler. The move, uh, movement rate is just always good. You are immortal. Thank you. And uh, what else are you? Replenishment is always good. You. Right. We realized Ghastly was pretty good. And do we give the, yeah, this is just good. Missile for uh, missile units, bonus damage is, that is good. So let's pass turn and see if someone walks into my ambush. So no ambush, but, oh, um, Oh, I don't know which which one is the Smuggler's Cove. I think that's... I don't know. Let's just take it. Get 100 more each turn. That was 15 turns, so it was not worth it. So, we can go and kill Tic-Tac-Toe now. But I... Th um, 
I don't think there's any point of letting this guy join, so let's just lightning lightning strike him out. And yeah, it's not a very impressive army, but I don't want him to join anyway. Charge bonus can go to these again. So auto resolve that. Good. And I suppose treasury. And now we attack tic tac toe. Yes. I think this is not a good map for them. <laughs> Because, well, they're gonna be funneled, and uh, you don't want to be funneled while Queen Bess is shooting at you. Now, do you? That is the last thing that you would want. I mean, it's very flat, which is not great for us, but other than that, chokes are great for us. So, let's put you there. We can put you in the middle-ish and put you there, I guess. And I suppose we can just do a little bit like that. Mm. Actually, that's a little bit too much. I don't know why I'm fiddling so much. This isn't a like a super hard fight. So put up our those guys, our Necrofix Colossi, and I'm just gonna have a look at them. Um, Start deployment. I love these guys. They're a fucking ship mech. <laughs> How can you not love these? They are awesome. So, um, I guess you there, you there, you there. We have so many characters. And it's great. And yeah, that's good. Let's grab all of you. You, you, and you. And move you forward a little bit so you're not on the gun line. And I forget, forgot to m move you, but we can just move you over there. Let's put out some horses. Plop and horse and start that. That is such a weird thing. I've never seen anything else do that, like ever. Let's pop the, uh, those out there. And we're just gonna go ram this in there. We have so much artillery, we just we just want to slow them down, honestly. Come on, give us a shot. Come on. There you go. Yes. I love the Colossi. They're just... I find them super cool. So, can we get some good explosions here as well? This is a wonderful blob. And their flyers aren't doing well against our, our gun line, but here is Queen Bess and... Good night, lizard friends. Oh, it's so good. So good. It's unfair how good that is. So, you guys shoot that. And we have some casters and there's a skink oracle uh, running around here. That's fine. Uh, we can plop you down. We can do some stuff with that. And here's the gun line in range. This guy is gonna melt. <laughs> and a right hook from Silostra there. Oh, that is... Come on, one more punch. Come on, right hook. There you go. That was beautiful. Oh, they're actually... We got through our ghosts. Oh, no. Whatever shall we do? Oh, don't chase. Whoops. Okay, just... Go in there. Oh, and Tic-Tac-Toe is 
one on one uh, Silo Strand. It's not going that well. How come? Who'd have thunk a uh, giant hermit crab with a ghost opera singer on the back could ever beat a little skink on a pterodactyl? Oh, you are taking way more damage than you should. Get in there. Let's get some more horses. Come on. Shoot those. Oh, Tic Tac Toe is back. Can't have that. And you really need to back off. And this was a silly fight. I mean, it's fine. We didn't take much damage or anything, but... Got a little silly. Well, they're dead now, so... I didn't really take it seriously. What was that jerky movement? Either way, I didn't really take this seriously because, well, we basically just had to... We could autopilot that, I think. Just put up a, a gun line, cannons, the and the big characters and stuff at the front end. I don't think it would have been much difference. So let's race that. Get some... Oh! I think we just... Got on the top of the uh, on the infamy list. Awesome. Um, is there any? There is a couple of banners that we don't have equipped because we have ships, necromancer, and stuff like that. So maybe we should. This is this is not a great banner. This is meh. But I do want. Hold banner of militia. And uh, I think this is from technology. Uh, well, both of these are from technologies, I think. Do we have anything else than this? No. Okay. I guess gleaming pendant is fine. So. Um, yeah. I think we're going to end the episode there because we just got on the top of the infamy list and we should start moving north. Otherwise, I guess we can use two armies to take care of that last army that's going to spawn. Because uh, they might just go west and start attacking these, but with two of them, we should be able to handle it just fine. So... Yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, consider leaving a comment and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.